Here in Cincinnati for the AFC Championship between the Bills and the Bengals. Bengals went undefeated on the year, and they are looking for that undefeated 19-0 season. So we'll start things off with them in the first quarter. Andy Dalton hooks up with Pierre Garçon over the middle. And now on the 35, it's third and one. Gio Bernard is stuffed by two Bills defenders. It's fourth and inches. They settle for a field goal. Makes it a 3-0 Cincinnati lead. Later on in the first, the Bills have the ball at about midfield. Tyrod Taylor drops back, steps up in the pocket. He goes, takes off for the first down himself, slides down at that 38. Now it's third and 15. They need a conversion, and Tyrod finds McCollum, the rookie receiver. They, however, would settle for a field goal as well, as it would be a 3-3 tie game heading into the second quarter. So second quarter action, Andy Dalton, play action to Bernard. He's going to find Eifert. Going out to the outside, he's going to get down into Buffalo territory. But once again, they settle for a field goal. 6-3 Cincinnati lead. And here is where things started going off the rails for the Bengals. Tyrod Taylor over the middle has Sammy Watkins down to the 44. Very next play, Taylor hooks up with Watkins. He's going to go 56 yards to the promised land. Touchdown, Sammy Watkins. It's a 10-6 Buffalo lead. We'll pick things up later on in the second with the Bills on offense yet again after a quick stop on defense. Tyrod finds McCollum, spins out of a tackle, gets taken down to the 30. Now on the 20, 22 seconds left in the game. Play action. Tyrod Taylor finds McCollum. Touchdown, Bills. They'll take a 17-6 lead heading into halftime. It's 20-6 now as they kick the field goal in the third. And we are in the fourth quarter as Adolphus Washington with a big sack to put the Bills out of field goal range. So it's still 20 to 6. And then Tyrod Taylor finds McCollum, and he's going to put into the end zone. 27 to 6. Bills take the even bigger lead. And that was pretty much the nail in the coffin. But then with less than two minutes left, the Bengals trying to do something. And Ronald Darby is going to pick it off and give the Buffalo Bills back with the ball. And then no mercy for the undefeated Bengals. As they're going to go down, they're going to go down hard as the Bills come out with an absolutely disrespectful move. Bomb it up to Sammy Watkins. Touchdown, Bills, yet again. 34-6 to is going to be your final miss one on the nice 69-yard touchdown to Watkins. So 34-6 is your final. The Buffalo Bills come out on top over the Cincinnati Bengals as the Bengals' undefeated season comes to an end. And the Bills will be moving on to the Super Bowl to take on the New Orleans Saints in Minnesota. Some stats on the day. Tyrod Taylor went 18 for 24 with 371 yards through the air and four touchdowns. 167 of those on seven catches went to McCollum with two touchdowns. And then Sammy Watkins had four catches for 140 and two touchdowns. Big passing day for the Bills to get past this Bengals team as they're moving on to the Super Bowl. And with that being said, that's going to wrap things up here for this edition of Buffalo Bills football. I've been your host, Jersey Born, and I'm saying we'll see you for the Super Bowl. Wait and see because you know you need somebody. I said the love you lost is just a one of the cost. When you're living in the streets and you're running from cops. And every day is a surprise to fail when you're living by the words and the things you say.